guys, it's Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you my career mode, my Man United one. Um, I'm probably going to be trying to bring this out three times a week. And yeah, as you can see, I'm just starting up, etc. This is just going to be the pre-season friendly tournament and uh, training, etc. Starting it up. I'm not going to be doing any transfers. I probably should have turned off the first summer transfer window, but I'm not going to be doing any until January. I want to make it realistic. You know, kind of use the players we've got now, like Martial, Memphis, Matt, uh, Rooney, all them. I just want to keep them. And as you can see now, I'm training them. I've sped this first bit up because obviously it's it's not really that um, exciting or whatever. It's just training. But I've showed you what I've been doing. Um, also, if, the, if you've got any tips of who I should train, I'm going for the youngsters like Martial, uh, Shaw, um, Memphis, Pereira, Lingard, players like that. Um, let me know. Who I should train, is there any other ones that you think, maybe Herrera, Mata, etc. I think I did train Mata on this one, actually. But as you can see, I'm doing pretty well with the, the training uh, resumes. I, I've also simmed some training stuff, and I, the CPUs kind of vary, and sometimes they do really, really well and get like a F. Sorry, that's bad. <laughs> really bad and get an F, and sometimes they'll get an A. It just really depends. You can also retry these three times. So I did that a couple of times, as you can see with the dribbling techniques that we've got now. And um, yeah, they're pretty good, to be honest. Like, I'm not going to do them every single time. I'll simulate some, but apparently they do really help. So I'm going to be doing them quite a lot. I'll simulate a lot of them. And as I say, this is just the normal stuff just starting up etc also in january let me know who you do want me to sign i'm going to be looking for a center back and a striker primarily maybe um a right wing etc we'll see what happens with that but i like the balance in the team in terms of the midfield and um also the fullback options are very decent i can use rojo there i can use blind there Shaw obviously darmian maybe we need a right back in the summer as well goalkeepers were perfectly sorted to hear valdez it's just up front we're lacking a bit, we've only got Rooney, Wilson and Martial. But um, as you can see we're coming to the end of these training uh, schedule things. But I did pretty well in them and I'm not sure how long it takes to upgrade a player. Like um, There's a bar that appears at the bottom and it seems to go down if you get, I think, lower than a C it'll go down. If you get higher then it'll go gradually up and I think it... it um, potential comes into it so the younger the player etc the easier they're going to find it to up them in their stats so anyway let's get on to the games right so the first game we've got is Sounders uh Josh Weir I think wanted to play in this so I decided to put him in the midfield I also put Andros Pereira in there giving a couple of youngsters a chance obviously and uh, yeah trying to keep the squad happy it was again Sounders so I thought this would be relatively easy but I did put the difficulty on world class and I've got to say, I hate the way the CPU plays on World Class. They just keep the ball. It's primarily possession. That's all they're bothered about. And it really is frustrating. But anyway, in the 16th minute here, we get a free kick. I deliver it in with Memphis. And Spinesteiger gets on the end. But that's a great save from his keeper. So I didn't score, unfortunately. Then Sounders get the ball here. And they run down the wing with uh, Pineda as that. And that cross, I don't know how the hell the player gets it. It's such a narrow angle. But they score. And it's 1-0 at this point. And then Josh Weir does very, very well to get the ball. He pan uh, passes it off to Martial, who has a shot. It's uh, deflected. Comes out to Pereira, who just slots that in. Well, smashes it, kind of. And that's 1-1. Davy goal for Pereira in a friendly. And then later on here, look at that. Like, <laughs> a ridiculous shot there. My defenders couldn't get anywhere near. And in the 86th minute, Sounders go on to win. 2-1. And that, unfortunately, is how it ends. As you can see, they had two shots on target. I had five. But I couldn't, uh, you know, score. His keeper was pretty good. In this one, we give a few more debutants. Um, I think I've played a very strong lineup, but I've got Fellaini up front and Herrera in the midfield, um, just to give Martial a bit of a rest and, you know, rotate a little bit more. And what a goal that is from Juventus! Like first touch, straight finesse outside the box, and they somehow score. And I, I just couldn't believe that. And then, yeah, they're just doing this tiki taka bollocks that I hate. But I do manage to get the ball back with Memphis. I cross it into Fellaini who scores, but it's offside, unfortunately. And that was literally, I think, one of the only chances I had. And then Marquisio here. What pissed me off about this? The advantage was played. They played on, and the ref still gives the foul. And of course, from the resulting free kick, Hernanez scores. 
So it's 2-0. There's not a lot I could do there. And I was very annoyed because I, I thought the advantage had um, ended, but apparently not. But Martial dribbling through here. I managed to get a nice little kind of fake. The shot's deflected, but it still goes in. But we still lose 2-1. So that's two consecutive losses. Not the best start to this career, but it's only friendlies. Obviously, these ones don't matter, but I do need to improve for um, the later games in the league. The only changes I made here, I think I put Young at left back. I put Pereira back in the team for Rooney uh, just to you know mix it up against Real Madrid, who probably are the hardest team, but they did play a lot of uh, youngsters. And I threw ball it with Memphis to Martial here, gets a lot of space, tries to take the shot, but the keeper saves. Maybe I should have took the shot a bit earlier. But from the resulting corner, Mata whips in across and Smalling, who apparently hasn't been doing very well in this career, uh, heads it in. So that's 1-0 to us. And then just before half-time here, Real Madrid carving through me, to be honest. Like, Bale, look at that. There's no effort there. And I don't know how the hell that goes in at the near post, but it does. 1-1. I play the ball through to Pereira here, who's exhausted, but he manages to get a cross in and Schneidlin. A bit unlucky there. Great save from the keeper. That would have been 2-1, but unfortunately I couldn't score. Fellaini here, I subbed him on, brings it into Memphis, who has a shot and the keeper catches it, unfortunately, and that was in the 90th minute. And we lose, uh, sorry, we draw this one, 1-1, but I absolutely dominated Real Madrid, seven shots, seven on target. Possession, I only get like 30 to 40% on world class, I fucking hate the CPU. So anyway, next game will be the start of the Premier League, we'll be playing Spurs, etc. Hopefully you have enjoyed, and yeah, peace.